for another Jazz Guitar Chords video. And today we're going to add two color tones or upper structures to a minor 7 chord. Now if you checked out uh, video number 19, I had to check, I don't really remember all these numbers, but uh, we added a ninth to the A minor 7 chord. So we took that chord, A minor 7, and took the A note, moved it to the B, which is the ninth. So in this video, we're going to take that chord and add one more. So from the fifth, if you add, if you move the fifth over a whole step to the sixth, the sixth is the same as the thirteen. Now, if you don't have the seventh in the chord, then it will be considered a six. But if you, like a uh, major six chord, Beatles style would be like, there's no seventh there. But if we add the seventh, we get... Sounds more like a 13 now. Um, so the same thing with this with this uh, chord here, A minor seven. So we're going to take the root, the A, and the fifth, which is E, and move them both up a whole step. You get this chord, the, f the flat uh, seventh and the flat third stay the same, and you get. So we have A, a minor 7, and we're going to move the A to the B, which is the 9th, and the E to the F sharp, which is the 6th or the 13th, you get this chord. Check out that diagram. Now let's look at the one on the 7th position. Here's your root and your 5th, and both of those are going to go up a whole step, A to B, and E to F sharp. Two notes, the third and the seventh from before, the flat third and flat seventh stay there. And now we're going to play with the first finger and these two over here like that, and you get that chord. Check out that diagram. Now the, uh, the next A minor seven chord is here on the tenth fret. You have A and E, so A goes to B, E goes to F sharp. These two stay the same from before, and you get this chord. So look at that diagram also. And the last one, you have um, A minor 7 on the 13th fret. 2, 3, 1, 4. And your A and E, so your 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 E is here, and your A is here, and both of them go up once again a whole step, and you get this. You had these two notes from before, so the chord looks like that. You can also play that chord down in the first position as well. You get F sharp, B, C, G. You can also look at that diagram as well, for up there on the 13th fret. So when you play them in order, you get a very interesting sound, I always I feel. So you have A minor 9, 13 here, here, here. It's a very modern sound. And, you know, some of these chords, you can use them, depends on what music you're playing. You know, probably more modern, you know, music that leans towards a more modern sound, you can use them there. But it really depends. I mean, this chord can be... If you don't lean on it, you can still use it, you know. Uh, I happen to really love these chords. <laughs> but, uh, alright, so that's it for this, and once again, there is a sheet to download for this lesson and in the next video we're going to add a sharp 9 to the D7 sharp 5 that we had in video 20. So I'll see you next time uh, for Jazz Guitar Chords video and thanks for watching.